friends, it's Living Young Country Girl, and I'm gonna share with you guys a backpack that I just got for a carry-on. And now this actually fits into the personal item slot for budget airlines. Um, I'm gonna do a video actually after we finish this trip because I have not traveled on Spirit. This is our first time traveling on Spirit. We did travel on Allegiant a while ago. And I want to share with you guys kind of some of the things, some of the comparison after we travel, just so I can kind of share with you guys. If you're looking at budget airlines, what to expect and kind of how to kind of work the system, if you want to say that, so that way you can not pay all those extra fees. Now for Allegiant Airlines, honestly, the fees were not that bad, but for Spirit, they're quite a bit. So I'm going to show you guys, um, I got this Nordic backpack. I'm going to zoom in right there real quick. And this thing is amazing. So I'm going to flip the camera and show you the backpack empty and then show you what all I'm going to put in there. Okay. So you'll be amazed at what you can fit and how you can travel. We will be gone for, we'll be there for five days and two days travel. So a total of seven days and it's all going to fit into this backpack. Can you believe it? All right. Let me flip the camera. Okay, so I am going to get packing now. Now you can see here, I am going to attach the charger pack, the battery pack to the bag. There is a little port right here that you would actually attach um, from your phone to that port. And then you attach your battery pack on the inside and there's a pocket made perfectly for putting it in. So you can just store it right in there. And then this way, when you want to charge, you only have to connect a spot from the outside instead of having a cord um, or a port or anything and you never have to even deal with it. So I love the fact that it just nicely fits in there and that I can still have so much room to pack so many other things. There's so many compartments. There's a compartment right here for putting stuff in. There's multiple little compartments. There is actually even um, a spot to put your laptop that is very well padded, which is wonderful. Um, there is a spot for your water bottle on the side. There's also a padded area for your sunglasses and a key clip, which I love because it keeps everything safe and organized. And there are also three pockets on the side right here for organizing or putting whatever you would like, as well as the big spot. So I actually am putting my charger packs in here. Um, these are my big ones that have like five charger or 10 charger ports to it. And the reason I keep it right here because it's easy to grab. So when we are in airports, we all have our cords. And if there's only one plug, you can do that. Now here's where you plug in with one of the cords to the side if you need to charge your phone and you're moving around. But like I said, if we're actually sitting waiting for a plane and there's only one plug, I love to have this charger port um, set really easy to access. And then there's still room in there for putting other things if I want to, which I absolutely love. And I did actually stick a magazine in there, um, when we got on the plane. So, um, this backpack does come in a couple different colors. There's also a waterproof spot right here where you can put your toiletries and stuff in. Obviously with TSA, you have to take them out, but, um, even like a wet bathing suit, we had wet bathing suits on the last day and it was nice. So we could put them in there and it kept them dry. So that was wonderful. Um, I did put my toiletries, um, in there, but it, they didn't, it wouldn't zip up. So I decided not to keep them in there. Now I have my packing cube and I'm going to literally pack all of that clothes that I showed you in my packing cube and it's going to fit down on the very bottom and it fits in there nice and snug, but it works. Um, I had no problem zipping up the zipper and it still fit in there and it gave me lots of room to put in other things. Um, the side pocket, I put my flip flops because it kind of kept them away from getting everything else dirty. So I just stuck my flip flops in there. And of course, because I pack light, I always make sure I wear my biggest shoes, which was my tennis shoes. And I just put my flip flops that I do what did wear for beach days and stuff like that in there. And it kept them nice and clean. So I absolutely love that. Now, um, I also had the spot in the back and I put my beanies back there. The reason I put them back there is because they were really soft and I was not bringing a laptop. So it was just a really nice place to go ahead and stick them and it kept it nice and soft against my back. And it was just a great spot for it. Um, I did find a narrow water bottle. This is my Young Living water bottle. And you do want to make sure you find a narrower water bottle because the pocket is kind of small and tight. Um, but I was even able to still fit my tripod in there as well. 
And now I have all my toiletry bags, our toothbrushes, my hair accessories, all of those bags. They just fit nicely on top. Um, my flat ironing fit right in there as well. I just stuck it in one of the pockets that was in the side there. And, and then I had my actual wet toiletries that I needed to take out for TSA on the very top. And you can see with all of that in there, I actually still had some room. So um, we stuck some snacks in there that you know, we were going to use on the plane since we were flying budget, you know, you don't get snacks. So we grabbed some um, snacks that we had, and then I was still able to easily zip it up and have room. So loved, loved that. Now I did put my eyeglass case on top and not use the actual case only because I knew I'd be shoving it in places and I didn't want it to get stuck, but this fits perfectly under that seat in front of you. There is a spot right here for if you have a roll on suitcase or a suitcase with a handle, you can just put it right up there. And there's also a hidden pocket for protecting, let's say your passport, money, ID, things that you want to make sure that no one can get to. So I love that security about it. It's super quick, super easy. Um, and like I said, it comes in two colors. I did pick the lighter color. I wish I kind of would have gotten the darker color just because I don't want it to get dirty, but um, I am really happy I got the lighter color. And like, so there we go. I am all set. I've got my little bag right here and we are ready to go. And.